<laughs> your life depended on it. <laughs> huh? You distribute the seven. Yes. And then split them apart. Yes. And then get a on one. Yes. That's it. So break it up. Right? Break it up. Don't use the quotient rule. That's the worst thing you can do. So rewrite it. Just try to break it up. Distribute the seven and then go, go from there. So seven times one is seven. Seven times time, sign, ah, seven times sign is seven sine. So we're here. It's all over two cosine x. And now we'll break it up. Yeah, we're gonna break it up into two pieces. So it'll be this over this minus this over this. So now we break it up. So y equals, so seven over two cosine x minus, and then I'm, I'm not gonna write it as tan yet. I'll, I'll, I will in the next step. I'm showing some extra steps, right, showing some extra steps. Yeah, after this one, we'll take a break, like 15 minutes, and then we'll just keep going over math uh, drive after the break. Because there's, there's plenty of homework, like, I think. It's worth it. So there's a lot of homework. There's a lot of hard homework. Tons. So we're here. Any questions up to here on this one? On this one? Mm -hmm. Isn't one minus sine x like Ah, I see, Reese. Uh, you're thinking of this one. Sine squared plus cosine squared is one, so cosine squared is, yeah, and then also sine squared. So each of them is one minus the other one squared. Good question, Reese. Good. No, it's worth it. It's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, this is seven halves, and then what's one over cosine? What function is that? Do you all know? Secant, yeah. So this is secant. It's still y, by the way. We haven't, we haven't differentiated yet, so it's still... It's still y, and then minus uh, seven halves, and then sine over cosine is tangent. Yeah, tangent. So now we're finally at a place where we can take the derivative. So all of this is just rewriting, right? Rewriting of the original problem just to get to a place where we can differentiate. How would you know to do this? Just practice, experience, right? You do the homework, um, like you see it. You know, quotient rule is like really horrible. So now let's take the derivative and we'll finish. So y prime. So y prime. Um, so what's the derivative of secant? Do you all remember? Secant tangent. Yeah, so secant tangent. Secant tangent. And so minus. And then 7 halves. And then what's the derivative of tangent? Secant squared. Secant squared. Mm -hmm. Good, that's it. Any questions on this one? Any questions?